Calgary has a really rich culture of innovation and with regards to the environment, there's a very, very strong ethos of protecting the land. So there's a big emphasis on grass and grass growing. It's a very natural crop, I suppose. Our temperate climate, you know, really helps as well in terms of, of, of growing the grass. Small scale biorefineries can help to empower farmers in the bioeconomy and change their role in the bioeconomy from being suppliers of cheap biomass, typically for biofuel or bioethanol process, into producers of finished or semi-finished bio-based products. Biorefinery Gloss is an EIP Agri project. It's funded by the Department of Agriculture, Food and the Marine under the 2014 to 2020 Rural Development Programme. We have five partners spanning across research, agriculture and bioeconomy. So the project is led by Institute of Technology Tralee. We collaborate with the Carberry Group, the Barry Rook Co-op, University College Dublin and Grass at BV. It's Ireland's first grass biorefinery project and one of Europe's first small-scale biorefinery demonstration projects. We actually cut the fresh grass in the morning and in the afternoon. We bring it into the hopper uh, on the back of the machine. It's uh, actually crushed and pressed at the same time so we can access the components inside. At the moment you've got grass and the cows eat the grass so it's, it's one product. But the grass biorefinery actually we're producing four different byproducts. The first is a fibre cake, which is basically a drier silage. We've then got the protein, which is extracted, and that's very suitable for monogastrics, for pigs and poultry. We've got the FOS, which is a sugar, it's a prebiotic. That's a big, big thing nowadays for animal and human nutrition. And the last piece then is the grass whey, which is a fertiliser. Potentially, you know, massive benefits for rural Ireland and, and I suppose Ireland as a country. In Ireland, we import about 3 million tonnes of animal feed annually. Uh, through biorefinery glass, we expect to be able to improve the nitrogen use efficiency of Irish grassland by about 40%. We do that by a protein optimization process where we separate the proteins in grass that cows convert to milk at a higher efficiency into a fibre fraction, which is fed back to the cow resulting in less overall emissions produced by the cow and we separate the other 40% of protein which isn't used effectively by the cow into a separate portion that can be used by chickens or pigs as animal feed. We're delighted in Ballyra to be part of what is very futuristic technology with regard to what can be derived from grassland. Farming is constantly changing and it's incumbent on us to embrace any technology that could lead to opportunities for farming, particularly grass production. And if there are other things that we can do with grass, sure of course we should embrace the technology, you know.